Hello community! Yes, we have a now Mistral Medium now available here for the Enterprise Edition. And what we want to do is we want to compare it now with the Mistral Small model. You remember the Mistral Small? You look here, those are the performance data for different benchmarks. But of course, we are interested here in the real world performance. So Mistral Small, just to remember, we have currently powered here by the Mistral 8x7B version 0.1. A mixture of expert system is our small model. And the medium model here is an internal prototype by Mistral, Mistral AI. And if you look here now at the price, you see that currently, if you go with the JET completion API for the Enterprise Edition, currently for the mixture of expert model, you pay about for the output token 1.8 euro per 1 million token. And if you compare this now to the medium model here to the Enterprise Edition, the jump is here 400% for the costs that you have to pay. And the question is simple. Is it really 400% better performance that you get if you pay here for the Mistral Medium model? So let's have here a look at the real world performance task and you can judge if you want to spend 400% more on the new Mistral Medium LLM. Here we go. So here we are now. On the left side, we have Mistral Medium. And on the right side, we have our mixture of expert system, eight times a seven B Mistral. Great. What is the task? The task is easy. Imagine a hypothetical computational framework where LLMs based on advanced graph-based AI system is integrated in a quantum computer. And this integration enables the AI to manipulate and interact with the qubits directly allowing it to perform complex computation at a quantum level. Here are ideas how such an AI system could potentially solve the quantum version of the Turing halting problem, a problem considered undecidable in classical computation. Describe the implementation of this solution on Gödel's incompleteness theorems, yes, we are here in Vienna, and the George Turing tests, particularly in relation to the concept of quantum logic and the limit of computability. Additionally, analyze the potential repercussions of this breakthrough in terms of its impact on the field of quantum cryptography, the foundation of mathematics, and since we are here in this easy task, the philosophical understanding of consciousness and free will, especially considering the role of quantum mechanics in these domains. Your response should explore the theoretical underpinnings of quantum computing, the nuances of AI integration with quantum systems, and the profound philosophical and scientific implications of such a theoretical advancement. So you see, the task is rather simple, and this is the reason why we have AI system for complex task. So now let's see if Medium really outperforms here our mixture of expert system. Medium. I will attempt to theorize the potential capabilities and implication of such an advanced AI system. Yes. Undecidable, yes, quantum algorithms, sure, Grover's can solve certain problems exponentially faster than the classical algorithms, but they do not provide a general solution for the halting problem. However, if we assume that our hypothetical AI system can manipulate qubits directly and perform complex computation at a quantum level, it could potentially explore the vast solution space of the quantum halting problem more efficiently than a classical computer. This capability could stem from the principle of quantum superposition and entanglement, which allow quantum system to process multiple inputs simultaneously and establish some complex correlation between the qubits. The implications of solving the quantum halting problem would be profound for Gödel's incompleteness theorem and the George Turing thesis. Gödel's first incompleteness theorem states that any, any consistent formal system cannot prove all true statements within that system, while the second theorem states that the consistency of a formal system cannot be proven within that system. These theorems establish inherent limitations on the probability and completeness of mathematical system. Solving the quantum halting problem could potentially challenge Gödel incompleteness theorem by providing a decision procedure for determining the truth or falsehood of certain statements in quantum formal system. This development would have far-reaching consequences for the foundations of mathematics and logic. Regarding the Church-Turing thesis, which asserts that any effectively computable function can be calculated by a Turing machine, a quantum solution to the halting problem would imply 
but the quantum computers can compute functions beyond the capabilities of classical Turing machines, this breakthrough would necessitate an extension or modification of the Church-Turing thesis to accommodate quantum computation. The concept of quantum logic arises from the non-classical feature of quantum mechanics, such as superposition and entanglement, which do not confirm to traditional Boolean logic. Quantum logic provides a framework for reasoning about quantum system and the properties of solution to the quantum halting problem could further elucidate the nature of quantum layers, the relationship to classical logic potentially leading to a more comprehensive understanding. This is just some general blah blah blah. In terms of practical applications, a quantum solution to the holding problem could have significant implications for quantum cryptography. Quantum key distribution protocols provide secure communication based on the principle of quantum mechanics, rely on specific assumptions about the capabilities of eavesdroppers and the devices used for communication. A quantum computer capable of solving the holding problem could potentially break existing protocols by determining the underlying quantum state and correlations more effectively. Efficiently, this development would necessitate the creation of a new quantum cryptography technique that remains secure against advanced quantum adversaries. The philosophical understanding of consciousness and free will could also be affected by such a breakthrough. Quantum mechanics has been invoked in various theories of consciousness and the, uh, my goodness, orchestrated objective reduction model, no idea, proposes by Penrose, by Roger Penrose, my goodness, I should know this. Suggest that quantum phenomena play a crucial role in cognitive processes and the emergence of consciousness. If a quantum... Oh, I see. Now we see why AI is currently not conscious, because they are not cognitive quantum processes. Hey, I learned something today. If a quantum AI system could solve the holding problem, it might provide insights into the nature of quantum consciousness and the potential for artificial intelligence to achieve a form of consciousness or self-awareness. Additionally, the ability to accurate model and predict the behavior of quantum system could have implications for the understanding of free will, as it could potentially reconcile the apparent randomness of quantum mechanics with deterministic classical physics. In conclusion, the integration of advanced graph-based AI system with a quantum computer, as described in your hypothetical scenario, could potentially solve the quantum version of the holding problem. This breakthrough would have profound implications for the foundations of mathematics, logic, and computability as well as practical applications in quantum cryptography and the philosophical understanding of consciousness and the free will. However, it is essential to acknowledge that this remains a highly speculative and theoretical proposition, and significant challenges must be overcome to realize such a computational powerful system. Okay, so whatever you feel, this is medium. And now let's look here at our mixture of expert system. You can read this with me in silence, and then we say, hey, is A better or is B better? This is a sentence, I don't know, I don't know, okay.
So what do you think? Is it model A or model B? Which one do you personally prefer? I have to tell you, it's not easy. It's not easy at all. So many different aspects that you can judge here. Okay, I would go for A is better. For this particular, yes. So I say, hey, explain step by step your reasoning pathway for your answer. So let's see. As you can see, the low distribution between these two problems is definitely tuned towards here, the left model. Let's see if the left model finishes how the right model, our mixture of expert system, will accelerate to get an idea if we would switch the position of those two models here. And you see? Okay, so let's have a look at this. Heaven's sake. Now it really gets deep into the understanding, but this is exactly what we want because we want to be able to really judge which model is better. So again, silence and let's start to read. Now, if you're ready, I would say it's this is really I it's almost a tie, but I think they are more or less on the same level. But maybe there's a nuance that A is better, but this is really just almost unnoticeable. Okay, so let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's compare both models. Yep, so. A magic box can perform calculations using the principle of quantum mechanics, a branch of physics that describes the behavior of particles at very small scales. This magic box, or a quantum computer, can process many possibilities at once and find answers much faster than a regular computer. Now, let's say you have a program that you want to run on this magic box, something like you're baking a cake, but instead of ingredients and instruction in it contains mathematical operation, operations and logical decisions. Is a number even or odd? Why is this cake ready to come out of the oven? The quantum halting problem asks a seemingly simple question. Can you predict whether this program will eventually stop running and give you an answer? Or will it keep running forever like an endless loop? Case of a regular computer, it has been proven that there is no general method for predicting whether a program will halt or run forever. And this is known as the halting problem. This means that for some programs, it is impossible to know ahead of time if they will ever give you any answer. The quantum halting problem extends this question to quantum computers, even though quantum computers can process many possibilities at once and solve certain problems faster than regular computer. It is still believed that there is no general method for predicting whether a quantum program will eventually halt or run indefinitely. Quantum holding problem is the question of whether you can predict whether a quantum program will eventually stop running and give an answer will keep running forever. No solution. Okay. Imagine a quantum baker who makes cakes using quantum flour. Interesting. This is going to be interesting now. This quantum flour has a special property. It can be in two states simultaneously being half-baked and fully baked. Okay, quantum baker can mix their quantum flavor flour, put it in the oven and prepare four magic measurements that can make the quantum flour become fully baked or remain half-baked. 
This strange behavior is similar to what happens in a quantum computer where the basic units of information called qubits can exist in multiple states simultaneously. Now imagine a quantum baker has a recipe and the recipe is like a quantum computer program. The recipe tells the baker how to mix and bake the quantum flour based on specific instruction input. The quantum halting problem asks, can we always predict if the quantum baker will ever finish making cakes following the recipe, no matter what instructions are given? The reason this problem is so challenging is because of the strange property of quantum mechanics, superposition and the measurement problem. Superposition means that a quantum flower can be half-baked and fully baked at the same time, yeah? And the measurement problem implies that the final state of the quantum flower, whether it's half-baked or fully baked, can be only determined when we actually look at it. Yes. So, huh, just like we cannot always predict whether a regular computer will stop running with a particular input and also cannot predict with a certainty whether a quantum computer will ever stop running given any input, Due to the complex and unique properties of a quantum mechanics, this is the essence of the quantum halting problem. I would say it is nice that it comes up here, this system, with this quantum baker. This is somehow cute, and the quantum flower. So this shows me a sign of creativity, maybe a hint of intelligence, while here we have here a very... A very a temperature close to zero, I would imagine here, because this is rather the magic box, and we have a magic box. Yeah, I don't know. Here I would say I like B better. I think this is a more imaginative solution. You have now an idea about the performance of Mistral Medium, this enterprise graded edition by Mistral AI, and the free and available a mixture of expert system, the Mixtral 8 times a 7 b instruction model, where we unfortunately just have here the old version. And I think Mix Mixtral AI would like to update here and provide us with new open source LLMs. Wouldn't that be great?